I listened to all these experts who were lecturing us. I wanted to ask where they are coming from. If they are from Europe, UK, France, and so on. I wanted to ask how many elephants they still have in their countries. Because how do you destroy all your species and come and lecture me? We are having problem of overpopulation because we manage our resources properly. Our success is now our problem. And therefore, I think, the President, you can go, we can, you can be our ambassador to go to Europe and tell them how we have managed our resources. Because we are managing properly. That's why we have a problem. Overpopulation because we are managing properly. So really, uh, it's not like having line, British lines in rugby those days, British lines, and there are no lions in the UK. So Europeans must not little bit come and be humble and learn from us. The closure of legal ivory trade markets continues to create additional challenges to future efforts to dispose of these valuable stockpiles. There's no doubt that there is a need for deeper stakeholder conversations on this matter in an objective and realistic manner. As we approach CITES, let us therefore resolutely affirm our collective position on sustainable elephant conservation management. Let us boldly speak with one voice as a region in the best interest of our nations and our communities. The one size fits all approach of burning everything under CITES, disregarding the good efforts and investments by our respective governments is neither sustainable nor desirable. We must reject it. We, together with the local communities and various cooperating partners, have invested heavily in workable conservation policies, strategies, and laws. These will ensure that our region maintains its place on the great tourism and conservation maps of the world. This effort also speaks to the global and regional agenda for the Africa we want and the 2030 agenda for sustainable development. The Kaza Transfrontier Conservation Area is home to more than 250,000 elephants. Due to migrations, Kaza states are also planning to conduct a once-off count soon to determine the exact population as opposed to individual country counts.